It's a beautiful and breezy early morning out here in Goa where we have come to cover the on location of Sachin Joshi, Sunny Leone and Nasiruddin Shah star Jackpot. Uh, it's a comeback film of uh, Kaizad Gusta, the director of Boom and uh, Bombay Boys. Uh, Goa in monsoons is simply delirious and uh, we are having a great time out here. Let's get things rolling with a collage of Sunny Leone moments of the day. And yes, she looked very, very pretty and amazingly desirable. here in Goa and uh, Sunny is shooting for a movie Jackpot uh, uh, directed by Kaizad Gustad. Uh, now uh, what, what the director says is uh, it, it's, a, it's a performance oriented role for you as such. Uh, uh, people know you in a, in, in a certain manner but here you're doing a lot of like uh, kick-ass stuff and uh, I believe there are 12 changes that you're having in terms of your looks as well. There's a lot of different looks. There's a look with uh, Nasir sir and then there's a look with Sachin sir. So we have two different types of roles. You don't know which side of the fence I'm playing. Everybody in this movie has a little bit of a negative role, right. um, but it's fun to play those types of roles. It's fun to play roles that are not you. Right. And uh, I like it. I like all the costuming in this movie. is absolutely gorgeous. Right. I know a lot of guys will like it, but I think a lot of women will also say, hey, where, where did she get that dress? Because they're not, right. it's not wardrobe that is not something that any woman couldn't wear. Right. But still looks sexy, it's just tailored nice. Legendary actor Nasiruddin Shah is getting back once again with his Bombay Boys director Kaizad Gustad. Uh, more about his role from the movie. Jackpot, um, what exactly? You're playing, I think, um, uh, the boss of a casino. In I'm playing a boss of a casino who is also a bit of a freak who wears dreadlocks and carries a gun all the time. Yes. And it's a very uh, over the top uh, character. The kind Kaizad usually writes. The kind he wrote for Boom also, which was not so so successful. Right. But he, I think he he identifies more closely with the villains in the scripts that he writes. Right, right, right. There's more of him in the villain characters right. rather than in the hero characters. And it's great fun. I'm I'm almost through with my work. Uh, I've had a ball. You're having Sunny Leone uh, in, in the in the film as well. I think uh, she's she's. Uh, Playing the, she's uh, the mall. She's, she's, uh, she's, she's actually the central character. She's the secretary she, as well, I mean. She's the, yeah, a gangsters. Okay. Secretary serves many purposes, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, the three of them, that is uh, Sachin and Bharat and Sunny, are a sort of a gang. Everybody's trying to outwit everybody else, basically. Right. It's that kind of cat and mouse uh, script. And they're having a, I think uh, they're trying to outdo you and uh, you're having a plan for them as well, I believe. Yes, and everybody gets outdone by circumstances in the end. Kaizad Gustad is excited about Jackpot and yes, uh, there's a song from uh, Javed Jafri as well. If you remember, uh, Javed Jafri had done out a very, very uh, famous song called Mumbai in Bombay Boys. Uh, he's back with a, with, a, with a number in uh, Jackpot as well uh, as part of a promotional plan. Uh, let's find out what uh, Kaizad has to say about the movie and what's special about it. All my films have a certain thumbprint or a certain anghutha chap that says this is who I am. And style is a critical element of the entire film. So this film will have the same sense of itself. Well, it's actually a part of a con within a con within a con, what the whole movie is about. So Sachin Joshi's character, is a chap called Francis, has um, got a small team together. Two or three people have been together. There's one from Sunny Leone. Hai. Or ek Bharat hai, Tamil se. And the three of them plan a, a kind of a jhol, a caper, against the boss who's played by Nasiruddin Shah. And the boss in turn 
put such hold back on them. So it's a kind of a thriller, caper film that goes round and round. We don't know who's playing whom. Barish, Goa, July. So I've kept it very lazy and relaxed and as you can see, half pants and kichard. At least that's the director's style. I'd like to think the cast is more sophisticated than that. Yes, we've got amazing music in Jackpot. I'm very excited. We've got a track by Mika, we've got a track by Juno Reactor, we've got a track by Remo. Uh, we, I'm doing eight different tracks from eight different musicians worldwide. Maza hai, both maza hai. Music, it's a very musically inclined film. But there's no cut to item song. There will be a music video, but he's not in the movie. It's like a promotional video. Yeah. We got one by Mika, one by Javed, and uh, one by Remo. Time for some highlights from the shot of the movie that was being canned today. And yes, uh, the, the beat of uh, C uh, has been a constant element uh, in today's shoot as well. And uh, we just loved it absolutely. Kazad Gustav, because he has such a past also. He said, give me one year. And uh, my approach was always neutral. Like I do with everybody else. The moment I heard the script, I was sold. The script is so powerful of Jackpot and it is so interesting because Kahani mein samajh toh more or less sari filmo ke similar hi hoti hai lekin uska presentation, uska jo screenplay tha especially the screenplay of this film is very unique uh, matlab itni Hollywood film mein dekhi, itni Bollywood film mein dekhi ya kahaniya suni ek uh, screenplay mein jo naya andaz hai, woh mene ab tak nahi dekha so that was the most exciting part about Jackpot the whole film is completely not about a hero or a heroine getting together. It's about four people completely Quite trying to con each other. My character's name is Anthony, Anthony D'Souza. Anthony D'Souza. Initially, it was a proper going, but then they casted me. They thought, this guy is basically from Pondicherry, a Tamil guy who gets settled over in Goa. So since Kezad told me that, I thought, let me add a flavor to the film by adding a little bit of Tamil words to the film. So which is which is kind of getting into a trend right now because if you see Chennai Express, if you see Ranjana, right. so all those things are getting into it. So I thought let me also add that flavor to it by adding on a little bit of Tamil words to the Hindi film. So I'm basically called Pondi in the film because oh, okay. they call me Pondi. Oh. I've never felt I've been shooting. Okay. It's like holidaying in Goa. Uh -huh. So that's how uh, Jackpot sets has been so far. This is Faridun Sharir with cameraman Tahir Sheikh in Goa for Polyvarangama News Network.